All right, and for my final drink, I'm gonna go ahead and make a little classic called the Bourbon Ricky. So it actually, you have a uh, lime base. Some recipes will call for a Sprite. So we're gonna sub in that Sprite with some good stuff. So we have a lime white claw, um, and you go ahead and squeeze a whole lime into the juice as well, and then a shot of bourbon. Um, and then just for fun, I'm gonna throw a little bit of simple syrup in there just to kind of pull it all together. So first we're gonna put some ice in our shaker here. And then some bourbon. And then we're going to go ahead with the simple syrup. I would honestly do just a tiny, tiny bit. Simple syrup is one of those things where it's a lot goes a little. I mean, a little bit goes a long way. There we go. That's what I meant to say. Okay. So then I already went ahead and cut up my lime. <clears throat> we're going to go ahead and squeeze that in there. So you don't want to leave the rind in there. This isn't one of those cocktails where you want to like smash the lime and leave it in there. I would just go ahead and squeeze as much of the juice as you possibly can out. This is my husband's personal favorite right here. So hopefully you guys like it too. All right. Okay, as much as I could. All right, we're gonna go ahead and shake her up. And then, I'm just gonna recycle this ice actually. And pour that in there. Crack open our claw. I mean, that ice is seasoned, so we wanna wanna waste that ice, right? Pour a little bit of the claw. Ultimately, it's going to end up being about a half a can of the White Claw. Usually, all the drinks are about a half. You can pre-batch it and make a little bit more. I would put two shots of vodka in there if you want to use the whole can, if you're feeling frisky. Or if you have a friend, I guess, that you want to share with. Okay. And there you go. So, it's a nice little bourbon treat. Cheers. Cheers.